He got caught cheating. Dog, why you just didn't tell her what was going on, fam? Why you have to just sneak around and sneakily do it? You know she probably would have accepted it had you been open about it, dog. Wake up. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? You know what I could do to you? I don't know if she was insinuating because she seen that young chop on the beat over there that you know you you know what was gonna happen to you by that, but hey dog. When you got young chops around, fam, you don't know what they could do to you, dog. That's why I say just be up front. It's a lot of women that will accept poly, poly in their relationship, dog. It's just what it is, bro. Just be up front and tell her the truth, dog. What are we talk? Talk about what? Damn. No. Like I said, fam, you should have just talked to her prior to this, fam. Prior. Richard Pryor. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? What you doing is not enough to save your relationship at this point. It's just not enough. It's not enough. You could have just told her up front what was going on and maybe, just maybe, she would have been like, you know, we could possibly... Hey, you never know, dog. Because even if she didn't accept Polly, it's a lot of women that are willing to add another woman to their relationship to quote-unquote spice things up. I just did a video on it a few days ago, fam. That's why I be telling you, man, just be up front, bro. Stop lying about it. Stop you hugging her and holding her tight. I understand that there's more single women in the world that need love, but, bro, you need to be honest if you want to share your love, dog. Come on, fam. Hello. Are you serious? I'm going to see you, too. No, y'all perfect together. Listen, baby, we ain't perfect together. Me, you, and her could be perfect together. The perfect trio, and it ain't no third willing. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody third willing. We all in the same boat, fam. You know, even back in the day, like I said, our ancestors used to do polygamy all the time. There are still kings to this day that do polygamy. So people, stop looking at this as a threat to your relationship and start looking at it as a sisterhood, fam. It's just what it is. These people can better help your situation in a lot of ways. You feel what I'm saying? Like I said, you could send your child to a daycare or you could send your child right downstairs to your sister wife you feel what i'm saying it's not all it don't always got to be a competition you feel me sometimes it can better your lifestyle it's just what it is you got it now kudos to this woman because i love the way that she handled this situation i mean aside from the the the, the threat but her just leaving this situation